With gouache, the wet paint will change value as it dries down. We call this a drying shift. I'm going to show you how I handle this problem. So in this demo, I'm going to mix this three value, which is a mid-tone. And you can see my palette is a mid-tone as well. So on my palette, I'm mixing up black and white in search of a mid-tone. And if you'll notice, wet, this paint looks lighter than a mid-tone. It actually looks like the step above the mid-tone. I purposefully mix it lighter because I know this pigment will dry darker. So I'm doing a test where I'm drying this little layer and then I'm going to compare it to my value scale. It's pretty astounding to see how much the paint ch changes as it dries. So here I'm comparing dry layers to each other. Then I paint my entire painting that mid-tone. Let it dry, make sure it's dried completely, and you can see it drying darker. And then I recheck my value scale with the dry layer. Colors that are mixed with a lot of white tend to dry darker, as we've just seen, but dark colors tend to dry lighter. Go to handprint.com for more information.